I'm the first sales guy they ever hired, and I've only been around for two years. So we've grown to 150 employees, 42 injection molding presses without a sales presence. So uh, obviously we're doing something right. Hi, my name is Brian from Forum Plastics, located in Waterbury, Connecticut. We specialize in making devices like this via medical injection molding and precision injection molding. We have a Class A clean room where we perform our assembly of our medical devices requiring this kind of uh, space. Uh, usually the secondary operations are done in that room to support uh, an assembly operation that needs uh, the Class A clean room. This would be an example here where you have the molding of the product and then this product and all of these individual components are molded outside the clean room. But then they're brought in the clean room and then they're put together and actually ultrasonically welded to make this finished device. We do packaging from a, from a bulk side of things or if somebody has a 1Z or 2Z uh, type of packaging, uh, we can do that in the clean room as well. After you have your part injection molded, Forum can get you pad printing done as well. Here at Forum, we have 19 pad printing machines. We have experience pad printing a variety of different polymers uh, that are you know, in the medical industry or in the non-medical industry. For instance, this is a, a cyclic olefin material, very hard to print and get adhesion of the inks to. Here's another example of pad printing on a curved surface. Typically not a very easy job to do, but for them, we can do that. Look at this one. This one's printed all the way around. One of the core things that we do is insert molding. So here is a product that we overmold and is a critical part for a medical device. The tooth to tooth variation on this product is so critical, it goes into a stapler type device. Failure is not an option in the operating room. That's why customers come to Forum to get the confidence in the tolerancing. So, I mean, our molding machines are 10 ton to 200 ton. Our largest platen size in the molding machine is 19 inches square. We're typically in the one to four cavity range tooling, uh, only because in the end of the day, the volumes support that kind of thing, but we have as high as 16 cavity molds. So we do, we have a full service machine shop in house. The company was founded on building of injection molds. The molds, we guarantee certain molds for certain cycles, so we build what you call class 103 molds, which are guaranteed for 100,000, and 101 molds for a million. We can do class 102 as well. You pay for the mold, Forum guarantees the mold for that many cycles. If something happens to the mold before those cycles are up, Forum will take care of it. If you're having a problem with a current supplier and you want to switch, not a lot of places like to transfer molds, but Forum is okay with transferring molds. We also have a technology called a fiber printing technology. It allows you to get closer to the actual chemistry of your finished device. We can print the mold cavity out of this material. And this will get you up to around 100 pieces of the part that you're looking for in the material you're looking for. We call that in-mold prototyping at Forum Plastics because it's fast and it doesn't require any hard cutting of tooling material. See us and other quality suppliers at d2p.com.